Tampa Bay Funk Man. Learn how to sing and play in 60 minutes. Part three. Well, hello, folks. This is the Tampa Bay Funk Man. How are you all musically doing today? This is uh, the rule three. The third rule in how to play music in an hour or less. Learn how to play a song on a keyboard and sing it. You know, and really an unknown fact that people don't know about is music is very mathematical. It's very mathematical. And I'll, and I'll show you what I mean. Remember I've told you about major and I've told you about minor. I showed you practical terms what an interval was from where it was to where it's going to be. Uh, remember I showed you that part. Now let's talk about the third part. The third rule. Number three. The time signature or the tempo. You know that most music operates within a framework. In little things they call measures. Once again, I'm not going to teach you what a measure is in terms of music because once again I want you to hear it I want you to experience it and I want you to feel it when you talk about tempo you talk about what changes music over a period of time it's a time signature that means the time it actually takes to create that measure now a measure is simply like a sentence see John run that's a measure. See, John, run. See, I've said, I've said a complete statement. Well, that's what a measure is. Think in terms of four beats. Pretty much the world works on the four-beat measure. Okay? Four-beat measure. Okay? You're going to hear one, two, three, four. Again. One, two, three, and four. Quite simple. So I'd like you to count with me right now. One, two, three, four. Again. One, two, three, four. Add a little tempo. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Now, right now, we have a tempo. That's called tempo. You understand? Now, how does music work with tempos? Quite simply. If I sing within this tempo, la, 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 you see I just did that. One, two, three, four. Tempo again. Two, three, four. La, 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 la. Now what have I done there? Quite simply, I have created a measure of music. I changed the notes by way of intervals. Ba, 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 ba. See that change to the interval, the space of a note? I have taught you major, I've taught you minor, I've taught you an interval, and you know what tempo is now. You have the first three things, the first basics it takes. I'll explain to you later how that all works, but for right now, recognize those first three rules when you listen to music. Today, when you drive home, or you turn on the radio, or you listen to a soundtrack, or anything, listen for the major, the minor, the intervals, and most importantly, the tempo. Everything works with a tempo. Tempo can also mean the style of music. If it's a polka, it's going to be, it's going to be, boom, ba, boom, ba, boom, ba, boom, ba. If it's a rock and roll song, it's going to be, ba, 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 da, 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 da. If it's a waltz, doom, da, da, doom, da, da, doom, da, da, doom, da, da, doom, three. It's all tempo. Once again, it works on the mathematical tempo. The basic is four. Okay, let's try it at four again. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Add notes now. La, la, la. La, 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 
la, la, la. Very, very cool. I'm going to finish this video off with teaching you something, something else. Well, I'll tell you what. I'm going to wait, wait until the next video on this. Ne the next video is going to be really nice. I'm going to show you uh, what independence is. And I'm not talking about the 4th of July. Okay, this is the uh, Tampa Bay Funk Man teaching you how to play music in one hour or less. Once you know the rules, it's absolutely cool. See you later. It'd be nice.